So dear students, in this video, we are going to solve this problem. Okay. Sin raise to 6 z upon z minus pi by 2 raise to 3. It is looking difficult. Okay. So let us see how to solve this problem. So uh, what I'm trying to do in this complete playlist, I'm trying to cover each and every type of this type of complex integration. Okay. So it will definitely help you at a time of examination. If we cover all types, then if you get any kind of example in examination, you should able to, you can able to solve. Okay, I will suggest you one thing. Okay, uh, you are getting different different examples, but uske baad mein, you should try to solve those problems on your own. Then only you will get confidence to solve the problem, right? So let us solve this problem. Whatever the integration we have, let us call it as i. Let i is equal to integration over c sin raise to 6z upon z minus pi by 2 raise to 3 dz. Okay, this is integration. Hai. And c is so much important for us. What is c? Mod z is equal to 1. Where c is mod z is equal to 1. So, do you know this is equation of what? Uh, it is a standard form of equation of circle, right? This is standard form of equation of circle. Here, center is z0 and radius is r. Now, this is not in standard format because here is only mod z. Hai. What we expect? We expect mod z minus something. Nothing is there. That means 0 is there. So, mod z minus 0 is equal to 1. Okay. So, this is a circle now. You can easily see. Tell me, what is the center? Ke? Center that means z naught, which is zero. Basically, zero means zero plus zero i. So the center is zero comma zero. And what will be its radius? Radius is this right hand side, which is one, which is always a real number. Okay. So abhi ye dekho, ye circle draw kar lete pehle. This is imaginary axis, this is real axis. Let us have some scaling: one, two, minus one, one, minus one. Okay, uska center kya hai? zero zero. Or radius k 1. So, you, we will have the circle like this. This is our circle. That's it. Radius is 1 here. Okay. Let us move further. Now, what do we do? This function, hai, we will call it as capital F and we will find its singular point. So, here, here, capital F of z is sin raise to 6z upon z minus pi by 2 raise to 3. This is our function. Now, we will find singular points. Find karenge. Singular point that means the where the function is not analytic. See, here the numerator hai, is sin z which is always analytic. Sin raise to 6 but basically the main function is sin z which is always analytic and the denominator is z minus pi by 2 looking a polynomial function that is also analytic. Now, this is analytic when it is denominator 0. If it is denominator 0, then it will become ki infinity. So, therefore, the function is not analytic. But now, when it is denominator 0, when it is denominator 0, if it is not analytic, if it is not analytic, if z is equal to pi by 2. अगर z के value pi by 2 बनती है, तो pi by 2 minus pi by 2 तो 0 हो जाएगा ना? So, the function is not analytic at z is equal to pi by 2. See, what is the value of pi? It is 3.142 divided by 2. So, if you divide you with the help of Cal C, it point 1.571, something like that. Okay, ये point मिल रहा है हमको. एक ही point है, एक ही point है. उसका खाली cube है, okay? Point तो एक ही है. So, this point pe function analytic nahi hai. That means that is a singular point. Now, our next task is to check whether that point lies inside the circle or outside the circle. Abhi dekhenge, ye 1.57, approximately 1.5. Kaha pe hota hai 1.5? Real hai na? Real. So, real axis pe hi rehega. Yaha pe ho rehe. Yane ke iska ek hi singular point se, wo bhi bahar lai ho rehe. अगर सिंगुलर पॉइंट्स बाहर लाए हो रहे हैं तो हम क्या यूज करते हैं कोचिस थ्योरम यूज करते हैं इंटीग्रल फार्मूला और एक्सटेंशन कोचिस थ्योरम इफ पॉइंट सिंगुलर पॉइंट्स लाए आउटसाइड दो ही ऑप्शन है देखो इसको सिंगुलर पॉइंट्स ही नहीं है तो कोचिस थ्योरम अगर हो भी वो सर्कल के और रीजन के बाहर लाए होना चाहिए देन वी गो फॉर कोचिस थ्योरम सो लेट मी क्लियरली डिक्लेअर दिस पॉइंट लाइज 
आउटसाइड सी अब ये जो पॉइंट है वो सर्कल के बाहर है राइट पॉइंट है वो सर्कल के बाहर है दैट इज दैट इज अवर फंक्शन एफ इज एनालिटिक इन साइड एंड ऑन सी एक ही पॉइंट है जहां पे फंक्शन एनालिटिक नहीं है वो सर्कल के बाहर है यानी कि फंक्शन इस सर्कल के अंदर और सर्कल के बाउंड्री पे एनालिटिक है सो इफ इज एनालिटिक इन साइड एंड ऑन सी यही तो कंडीशन है कोचिस थ्योरम की राइट सेम कंडीशन हमको मिल रही है सो दे आर फोर आई कैन अप्लाई कोचिस थ्योरम सो दे आर फोर बाय कोचिस थ्योरम क्या आएगा हमारे कोचिस थ्योरम से इंटीग्रेशन के वैल्यू जीरो दैट्स इट फिनिश सो बाय कोचिस थ्योरम द वैल्यू ऑफ इंटीग्रेशन ओवर सी sin रेस टू 6z अपॉन z माइनस पाई बाय 2 रेस टू 3 dz जीरो दैट्स इट फिनिश एक्चुअली इनिशियली द प्रॉब्लम वाज लुकिंग डिफिकल्ट नो बट because of just that cauchy's theorem we directly got its value and it is zero right so the problem is over make a screenshot of it and then we will stop thank you see you in next video